fun part. This is a three foot by three foot sheet of decorative aluminum. And you can get this at Home Depot or Lowe's uh, for about 30 bucks, so it's not cheap. And you can see I've already used some of it. Uh, but the good thing is that I can use a sheet this size to, to make new covers for all three of the air intake vents in my house. So at least I'm gonna get a lot out of it. Just lay your frame on here and mark out where you wanna cut it. And you're gonna need something that you can cut through this with. I'm using these Fiskars shears and these are the most amazing scissors. I love these. These things just, oh, they just cut through it like butter. I love them. I'm just trimming this down a little bit more because I want to be able to uh, get the screws through the front of it without hitting metal because that's kind of hard to <laughs> hard to drill through. Uh, so I'm just cutting it down just enough so that I've got enough space at the top and the bottom to put the screws in. All right, and now get the staple gun again and just add staples around the edge to hold it in. All right, ta-da, pretty cool, huh? Now you just paint it. And definitely wanna get a good primer on this because you know the paint is gonna chip off of this metal pretty seriously if you don't. Uh, now, my friend Laura, who actually showed me how to do this, uh, she suggested using uh, automotive primer, like for cars, which is great if you have it. I don't happen to have that though, so I'm just gonna use some Zinser, which is my favorite anyway. I'm just using trim paint for this, just, you know, the same as the trim on the inside of my house so everything will match. You can do it any color you want. 